Sweet Pumpkin. Halloween is almost here. I've told everyone about your coming. Forgive me if I sound blunt, but if you don't show up this year, you've had it. I'll hold the ball and you kick it. Oh, brother. I don't mind your dishonesty half as much as I mind your opinion of me. You must think I'm really stupid. I know you don't trust me, Charlie Brown. You think that I'm going to pull this football away when you come running up to kick it. Well, here's a signed document testifying that I promise not to do it. It is signed. It's a signed document. I guess if you have a signed document in your possession, you can't go wrong. This year, I'm really going to kick that football. Peculiar thing about this document, it was never notarized. Getting the old pumpkin patch ready, huh? Yes, sir, boy. Each year, the great pumpkin rises out of the pumpkin patch, which he regards as the most sincere. Do you think this pumpkin patch looks sincere? Oh, yes. It looks very sincere. Well, it didn't look insincere. that you weren't safe sitting there. How humiliating. How do you feel about what Linus is doing? Doesn't it bother you to know that one of your friends is going to spend Halloween night sitting in a pumpkin patch waiting for the great pumpkin? It doesn't bother me because it doesn't affect me. Horrors! What do you want me to do? Get in ball? But he's your brother, isn't he? That blockhead! He's sitting out there in that pumpkin patch right now. That blockhead! He'll end up sitting there all night waiting for the great pumpkin. Aren't you concerned? He's going to sit there all night and nobody cares. That blockhead! Dear great pumpkin. Well, I waited and you didn't show up. It's a good thing that I'm young and can stand all these disappointments. Frankly, I've had it. The ones I feel sorry for are the older people who waited all night in their pumpkin patches for you to come. If I sound bitter, it's because I am. Sincerely, Linus Van Pelt. P.S. See you next year.